Birds in Nebraska are evolving at an insanely fast rate. What is causing this strange phenomenon? Oh, we are. Sorry, birds. Anthony here for Dean News, and evolution is this glacially slow thing, right? Over tons of time and incredible numbers of generations, tiny changes happen in species in response to natural selection or they just do it in a couple of decades because of us. Let's talk about cliff swallows. They like to build their nests on walls underneath overhangs and they build them in large colonies. You can find a lot of them building those colonies underneath highway overpasses. So there are these scientists that have been studying them on a particular stretch of road in Nebraska since 1982. They count the population, they tag individual birds to follow them through their lives, and they pick up dead birds they find along the side of the road to measure and preserve. And they notice something. Over the last 30 years, years, they found less and less roadkill. The numbers were down about 80%, but the number of nests and birds had doubled and the amount of traffic in the area was the same. So what was the deal? Well, they checked out the new dead birds and the old dead birds and all their data on cliff swallows that they had collected and all of the dead swallows had longer wingspans, like around 112 millimeters. And the average wingspan of all the swallows in the area was 106 millimeters. But in the 80s, the average wingspan of the swallows, dead or alive, was about 111. The birds were adapting to highway life fast. See, shorter wingspans allow birds to turn quickly, which means they're better at avoiding oncoming cars. All the dead birds had longer wingspans. They were being weeded out. Survival of the fittest in action and on fast forward. John Hoogland from the University of Maryland Center for Environmental Science thinks it's rad. He said, we humans, because we're changing the environment so much, are adding a new kind of natural selection to these animal populations. The thought is that if it's happening to the cliff swallow, it could be happening in more species, animals adapting to us being on the earth even faster than we thought was possible. And that's pretty good news. But I also have to wonder, is it really natural selection? It seems like some insanely artificial selection to me. We're directly causing an entire species to change to work around us. They might turn faster, but could we be causing other changes to them that are actually harmful? What do you guys think? Do you see this as the Earth being one step ahead of us, or are we just bending it too much to our whim? Let me know down below and subscribe for more D News.